What's happening, sports fans? I am Kendrick, the sports guy. We're talking Team USA, and the men's team will not be playing for gold. This time at the World Cup, and for the second consecutive time in FIBA's biggest tournament, there might not be any medal at all for Team USA. Instead, it is Germany that is moving on to the gold medal round. Uh, the German size gave the U.S. men fits during this game, and Germany got the first win, their first win over the U.S. men's team, 113-111 in the World Cup semifinals on Friday night. Uh, the U.S. had a smaller lineup. They just couldn't, couldn't match the size of Germany. Uh, Germany led for 30 of the game's 40 minutes. The U.S. led for about four and a half, and there was little question who was controlling play much of the way. Now, Germany was the last unbeaten team left in the tournament at 7-0. and oh, We'll play Serbia on Sunday for the World Cup title. Serbia beat Canada in the first semifinal, getting to its second World Cup final in the last three tournaments. It lost 129-92 to the U.S. in the 2014 championship game. Canada will play the U.S. for bronze on Sunday. That's around 4.40 a.m. on ESPN+. Now, Anthony Edwards led the U.S. with 23 points, which ended the tournament at 5-2. and two. They got 21 points from Austin Reeves, 17 from Mikael Bridges, and 15 from Jalen Brunson. The Americans shot 58%, but let Germany shoot 58% as well, and that was the ultimate undoing. Germany had been 0-6 against the U.S. men's team in World Cup or Olympic competition, usually getting blown out in those games. But not this time. Once again, even bringing the only roster filled with all NBA players wasn't enough for the U.S. at the World Cup. The Americans finished seventh at the 2019 World Cup in China. This finish, third or fourth, would technically be better, but nothing other than gold was going to be satisfactory for USA basketball. So again, the talk is, what's next? The Olympics are coming up in 2024. Will the bigger names play for the U.S. men's team? Uh, again, I think uh, Steve Kerr was leading this team as well as Tyron Lu and Eric Spolestra. They're going to have uh, some things to do. They got to get a little bit more size. Again, Germany out-rebounded them, and they were they, they pretty much the whole tournament they were undersized against all the other other world teams. So uh, we'll see. I, I, you know, my thoughts. I, I, I think the the world is caught up with the Americans in basketball. Let's be honest. It is a global sport. The international play is a little bit different now, uh, and it takes time for the USA team to adjust because they don't play together like that. But you can't make those excuses. The most of those international players are playing in the NBA, you know, such as Germany. So, you know, you got to play the game. You got to get out there and you got to perform. So, again, I, I, where does this rank as disappointing? I, I, I don't know. Uh, we expected them to win gold. But, you know, got to settle for third, come back home, and uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, I'd like to know what you guys think about this game, about the USA men, men's team in general. Uh, leave a comment. Uh, make sure you like the video and subscribe to the channel. I'm Kendrick. We will see you on the other side and on the next report. I'm out. Peace.